Good evening. Greetings and salutations, citizens of what was once a great, proud America. It is I, Citizen Anderson, here tonight to talk about the status and state of what was once our great nation, hearkening upon the legendary Theodore Roosevelt, you have entered Lex Anderson world, AKA the law, coming through for a quick fireside chat in regards to you know who, Trump number 45, ass clown ass. Of course, we're changing it up for this episode because I was called to the Capitol. I was called to our nation's capital. I tried to meet with Mattis to see if he would not resign, if he would try to retract his resignation letter. But the damage is done, folks. Trump's ass clown ass done fucked up big time. And now we are entering, <clears throat> today's the 26th, so we are entering the fourth day of the federal government partial shutdown, but here in the law, Citizen Anderson, the fireside chats, we're gonna stay on the worst president in American history. I'm gonna be staying on his ass, keeping you, the American public, informed of what's going on. But first things first, some people have a trouble with our, with English vernacular. What does the word furlough mean? The word furlough, since the media keeps talking about it, means that you are placed on unpaid leave. So there is a stash of money waiting to pay these people when this partial shutdown is over. But again, having your money held and actually getting it is two different types of situations. And how dare this real life Grinch, number 45, play these underhanded dirty tactics and is telling the media that there are federal workers who agree with this partial federal government shutdown and that they're willing to sacrifice for this asinine $5.1 billion wall. America, You've got to be kidding me. This can't be the America that I know, but sadly it is because there's private funds. A GoFundMe account has raised over $14 million to help support the wall. Meanwhile, how's the clean water in Flint, Michigan going? Not doing so well. They still don't have proper, adequate drinking water. But what else is new? America always has money for war, but can't feed the poor. And speaking of poor, If you did or did not know, an eight-year-old Guatemalan boy passed away being held at the detention center. It was reported that he was running fever, flu-like symptoms five to seven days ago. They thought he was okay. He died in the custody of what was once a great nation. How arcane... How archaic can some foolish business manager turn president be? So one-side-minded, not even thinking of the big picture, a goddamn border wall. Excuse me, what doesn't laugh makes you cry, or what doesn't make you cry makes you laugh. But this... This isn't my America. This isn't your America. This is an America being funded by the GOP and the Republican Party who's got a dirty ass agenda. Just remember, folks, they always provide fictitious things in Hollywood before it materializes as a real life, real world situation. So all that, all those Purge movies, then the Purge being a TV series. Yeah, hmm, number 45, arcane, archaic, 
is currently leading what was once a great country down the path to ruin. That's what's going on. But I, Citizen Anderson, Citizen Anderson will not stand for that. And I will be here standing on the truth. Something that number 45 knows nothing about because he's filled with lies and deceit. And the media is just pushing the hidden agenda using this ass clown ass as the front runner for what's really going on behind the scenes. And I will keep you posted of what's going on behind the scenes. The stocks had a great rally today, though. Stocks got to rally back after four days of uncertainty because ass clown ass Trump wants to go crazy on Twitter attacking the federal rate. People, are you kidding me? Who does this kind of bullshit? Oh, he does. But guess what, America? That's what was given to us. That's what you voted for. So yeah, hold the white women accountable. They did this to America. And of course, we could also get into systematic racism and men of color and women of color losing the right to vote when they get arrested. But we'll just we'll we will have we're just gonna have to save that for another episode, for another fireside chat with your boy, Citizen Anderson. So thank you very much for tuning in to this video. Excuse me. Thank you very much for tuning into this video. That is all I have. Let me peer in closely. Yes, I've run a little bit over on my five-minute fireside chat, but it is important to let America know what is going on, and the people will not be silenced. There are other venues, there are other avenues to gain information. And I, Citizen Anderson, will be here to provide that information. So make sure that you do the right thing and press that button to your right to subscribe to this channel. And press that bell icon to your right. Ding! So you stay notified of any and all upcoming future videos. And this video was sponsored by my Women's Empowerment Graphic T-Shirt line at Freckles and Dimples. You can check us out on CelebrityHairCore.com. The t-shirts are at the bottom of the site. Or you can follow me on Twitter at Mr. Fifth Avenue. The account is in my bio at Freckles underscore Dimples. And also on the gram at Freckle underscore Freckles underscore Dimples. Check it out. It's all about our melanin. Our black girl magic. It's about our culture, saving it and preserving it. And you could do that. Look at that. I slay every day. To the gym for Netflix and chill, you tell me. Freckles and dimples. Check us out. And again, celebrityhaircore.com. Well, that is all I have for tonight. Oh, oh, okay. Here it is. Ah, shades. (laughs) Yeah, but this is what happens when you go live on every video. So once again, I am signing out. Citizen Anderson saying, God bless all of you citizens of America. For I will be standing here on guard day and night. Until next time, citizens of America, it is your boy, citizen, or no, your guy, Citizen Anderson, signing out. God bless America, and God bless each and every one of you.